Britney's foam rollers. All right, so guys, a uh, really useful and kind of different cool down mobility exercise that I like to do, actually using two foam rollers. You don't have to add two foam rollers, you can use just one, but I'm gonna show you how to do this little threading the needle technique um, with two. So basically what we're working on, on one side we're working on shoulder mobility, shoulder range of motion. On the other side we're doing um, a little bit of a posterior caps or back of the shoulder stretch, and we're combining that with a little bit of a rotation in the spine. So all we're gonna do is we're gonna take two foam rollers, you're gonna put one foam roller here, and one across this way. Put your palm on the one in front of you and kind of like a karate chop this way. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna bring this foam roller forward and this one across. And what you're doing is you're getting a good stretch in the shoulder, getting a posterior capsule stretch here and a little bit of rotation. So it's just a nice kind of more dynamic exercise, just getting some movement. And it also requires a little bit of control in your core. So again, a kneeling position going across, Get a good stretch. Now again, you can vary this however you like. You can go a little bit here, more here. You can go a more deep rotation and come back. I like to do about five to 10 with a nice hold of about five seconds. And then switch it up. Again, five to 10 the other direction. Start here and here, palm here. Little karate chop motion here. Go across, you can keep your head straight in front. You can allow a little rotation. You can do this as well with one foam roller. So you can take one and just kind of go across, go down this way, you can go across this way. Or you can have one hand in front and just roll that foam roller across. Any variation works. Um, it's a good as a warm up, good as a cool down. Again, I like the foam rollers as they add a little bit of a dynamic movement. You roll a little bit easier. So Guys, easy one to try uh, before training or after training. Just a good little multi-directional um, technique. You're getting the shoulders involved. You're getting um, the spine involved. Getting good rotation and good uh, motion in the shoulders. So, guys, hope that helps. Send me a comment down below if you have any questions. We'll see you next time.